Feeling like your room needs a makeover? We've got something for every budget. So whether you want to splash the cash or you have an eye for bargains, we've got you covered. An old tire can be turned into a cozy seat. Apply glue to the sides of the tire. Then stick a length of rope to the glue. Repeat this all the way around the tire. Next, you'll need a large sheet of material. Take a cushion and a circular piece of wood and cover with the material. Add some drops of glue to the cushion. And stick buttons to it. Place the cushion onto the tire. All that's left to do is get comfortable. It makes a great gaming chair. Place a drawing of a unicorn into a plastic folder. Start to trace around the unicorn directly onto the folder. It's more accurate than drawing freehand. All you have to do is follow the lines. Remove the paper from the wallet. Cut a square out of a cardboard box. And place the plastic folder on the box. Use tape to secure it in place. That's looking good! We're gonna need a flashlight for the next part. Place your flashlight in the box pointing towards the folder. Put the box to one side. Pour glow-in-the-dark paint into a tin of white paint. Mix the paint together until it's fully combined. Just like this. That's really bright! Grab your paintbrush! It's time to get creative! The box is acting like a projector! I can paint the unicorn onto the wall! This is going to look amazing! Oh, can't forget the tail! There, I'm done! Wow, this is perfect! Now for the good part! I don't need the flashlight anymore! Let's turn out the lights! Oh, it's better than a nightlight! I'll place these foam mats on the bathroom floor. It's so easy to join them up! I'll stop anything breaking on the tiles. Uh, what are you doing, mom? Can I help? This is the last piece. That should do it. Great job, mom! Achoo! <laughs> it worked! This was a good idea. I have a great decorating idea. I'll stick some tape to the wall. I'll section out parts of the wall. Um, what's this for, mom? You're going to create some art. Really? Wow, I can't believe you're letting me do this! This is so much fun! That's one section painted! I'll use different color paints for each part. It's a great way to cover old paint marks. All I have to do is stay in between the markings. Okay, mom, I'm done. Wow, I'm impressed. You're so talented. Now let's pull up the tape. You need to do it carefully. We don't want to ruin the painting. That looks great. Haha, <laughs> I'm an actual artist. I can use these pipes to decorate the room. I'll just connect them together and make a frame. A little bit of pink paint and it's ready! It's ideal for hanging my plans! And it's definitely adds some color to the room. Ah, my very own indoor garden! Cardboard is so versatile. There's so many things you can make with it. Okay, time to start building! I've made notches in the cardboard. The pieces just slide together. Who needs an expensive couch? I need to make it look good, though. Hmm, I'll use this sheet to cover it. And these balloons will do for the cushions. I'm glad I saved all these popsicle sticks. I'll glue them together into a box shape. This is just what I need. I'll put a bulb in the bottom. Now I've got a lamp! That was a bright idea! I'll cut this foam noodle in half, lengthways. And then I'll cut them again, this time into small sections. I'll use different colors. Now I'll arrange them into a pattern. I'll stick them together. A nice, soft rug. Wow, it really brightens up the room. I love it! 
LED strip lights are so useful. I'll stick it to the wall. I want to make it into a zigzag pattern. This is so simple to work with. Okay, what's next? Ah! I need some tape. I put the tape all around the LED lights. Now I'll stick cotton wool to the tape. I'll have to make sure that I cover all the tape and the LED lights. It's so fluffy! There! It looks like a cloud! But I'm not done yet. I still have some of these foam noodles. Wow! All those gym workouts are paying off! I need different colored foams for this next part. I'll take the foam together. Phew! That was some hard work. But it was totally worth it! Now I can see a rainbow every day! It looks great! But the best part is when it gets dark! This paint is the perfect color for the bedroom. It's good to get rid of the excess paint. We don't want any messy drops on the floor. This tool is ideal for making sure I have the right amount of paint on the brush. Ah, perfect! Oh yeah, look at that smooth action. I'll put some glue onto these wooden rails. I gotta make sure there's enough glue. Now I'll stick it to the wall. Got a few more to stick. So far so good. I need a ladder for this last piece. It may look pretty simple, but it makes a great feature on the wall. There's another job done! Phew, this is tough. Let's put these cabinets right here. Then we'll put another at the bottom. We'll put a sheet of wood over the top. I'll drill these hinges into the cabinets. This will come in handy. The drill makes it quick and easy. Now I'll make a hole in the wood. And then pass rope through it. I tied a hole in the other end. It's like a secret compartment! I can put all my things inside! Then we can close it back over! There's so much storage space! Okay, let's put a mattress on top of the cabinets. And put on the bed sheets. These cushions will make it soft and cozy. And we definitely need a teddy bear! Okay, put the wood right here. I've got these foam strips in half. And I'll cover the flat side and the glue. Now I'll stick it to the wood. I'll do it all the way across until the wood is covered with foam. Now I'll drape a sheet over the foam. I'll tuck the sheet in between the strips of foam. And now I have a headboard for my bed. Let's test it out. Oh, it does the job. Hmm, this wooden stand is pretty plain. So I'll cover it with this sky blue paint. I'll go nice and slow. I want an even coat of paint. Oh, it's such a nice color. I'll let the paint dry and move on to the next stage. I've cut a hole in the soda bottle. And I'll put fairy lights inside. I'll position the bottle onto the stand. I've put some decorative stones onto some nylon string. I'll hand them from the bottle. Now I need my glue gun. I'll put some glue onto the soda bottle. And then stick cotton wool to the bottle. I'll cover the whole bottle with the cotton wool. I don't want to leave any gaps. Wow! It's a rain cloud lamp! You don't need a large budget to decorate your room. Just a little imagination and some creativity. What was your favorite hack? Let us know in the comments below! Remember to share this video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more fun videos just like this one!